Hello you magical people welcome back on salt and sugar saga and we are back with yet another very delicious and healthy recipe that is hara bhara chila or split moong dal chila so for that of course i have taken some split moong dal here and i have washed it and soaked it overnight and now we going to make a paste so we don't have to make a very you know very smooth paste a very fine paste if some um, even the some grains of uh, dal is there that's fine so in that i'm going to add some ginger and some green chilies and because ultimately we have to make a paste of it so i'm not going to chop them really fine and we have some green chili you can add the green chili as per your taste so here we have a paste and right now it seems bit thick so we'll add a little water uh in total i've added around uh, this is 1 cup of a uh, split dal and in that i have added around half cup of water so you can add water according to the consistency the thickness of uh, the dal So we'll mix it really well. And the good thing is that we are not adding any flour, either a uh, besan or gram flour or plain flour, anything. We are just making just like that. So we are adding some more goodies in that. That is grated coconut. If you are adding fresh grated coconut, it's gonna taste like heaven. So try adding I. it wasn't available with me so i've added the dry one and we got to add some crush flex seeds and we all know this is so healthy followed by some baking soda some salt some cumin powder and keep mixing everything really well So lastly I have added some cumin seed we'll give it a good mix and then we'll start preparing our hara bhara chila Okay so before that we are preparing some stuffing also that will add some crunch in that so for that i have taken some red bell pepper you can add capsicum or any color bell pepper for that or even the spring onions that will work really great and uh, with that i'm taking some crumbled paneer okay so we have everything now now we'll grease our pan and the heat is on medium to high heat and i'm pouring almost 1/4 cup of batter and spread it evenly you don't have to make it really thin just spread it so that it it's like um, of a normal chapati thickness yeah it won't be like dosa it like it it will be um, thicker than dosa actually Okay so here i have drizzled around a teaspoon of oil and when it's cooked from the bottom then we'll flip it around and let it cook from other side as well Okay so here we have now the both sides are well cooked now we'll add our stuffing in that so i'm adding some cheese some bell pepper and season it with a sprinkle of salt and red chili powder and well it's time to roll it guys if you haven't yet subscribed this channel please do subscribe it by clicking on the logo of salt and sugar saga or by going on the subscribe button and do hit a bell icon so that you'll be notified for all the updates so let's prepare all other chilas in the same way 
So see, it's very easy breakfast and it won't take, you know, four to five minutes to prepare this chila. If you have everything ready, you can have this delicious and healthy breakfast every morning in just few minutes. So here we have. Enjoy it. Until next time, take care. Bye-bye. Keep watching Salt and Sugar Saga.